Tonight, we have Sarah Palin as our guest. We are happy to have her for the full hour. We will talk about her family, her future, and her politics. Welcome to the show, Sarah. How are you finding things now that you are out of office? Larry, thanks for inviting me on the show here tonight. I just want to tell the American people how proud I'm to be an American. Sarah, what would you do if you were on a plane and someone tried to blow it up? Well, Larry, I always try to stay in the back of the plane, and I'm sure if there was an explosion my section of the plane would be just fine. Well, Sarah, that's very interesting. What would you do if you were in a tall building and you saw an airplane heading towards you? Larry, I believe I would look towards the Lord and he would give me the answer. You know I have a lot of faith in our Creator. Do you feel that your experience as a governor prepares you for these types of disasters? Oh Larry, I've had so many disasters with my family, with my children, with my husband, and so much more. I know in the end, everything will be fine. And Larry, I'm so very proud to call myself an American. God bless America. Amen. Sarah, nobody really heard of you until the Republican convention, when they nominated you to be vice president. What are your qualifications, and what makes you think you can run this country if needed to? Well, Larry, as governor of Alaska, I have had close relationships with Russia. I know how to deal for region matters. What makes this country run is oil. We need to drill. We need to go down deep and shake things up down there, if you know what I mean. Larry, do you know what I mean? Have you ever seen me in my running outfit? Lots of guys are drilling for me, and I'm so happy my man Todd knows all about drilling. He has been drilling and drilling for years, that's why we have five children, if you know what I mean. The other part of me believes in a strong military, and I would make sure all of our military bombs are ready to take off on a moment's notice. Sarah, I think you will be a very interesting vice president, and I hope they find a place for you. That's all the time we have left with Sarah Palin. Good night America.